and welcome back to the channel on this video I want to talk a little bit about e-bikes versus mopeds or e-mopeds I should say so there you are looking at right now the aerial rider grizzly and you consider that an e-bike or a e-moped and let me hop on and we'll go for a ride and let's talk about it so what made me uh, think about doing a video on this is because I get once in a while I'll get comments from uh, viewers of the videos saying that the bike is not a e-bike it's a e-moped or a moped and so makes me uh, It makes me think, well, what is it? Is it, a, is it an e-bike or an e-moped? I thought it was an e-bike, but uh, let me know in the comments if you can exactly define. Now, we're talking electric, not gas-powered. So we're talking electric moped versus electric bicycle. What are the differences? Because really, I think they're really the same thing. Unless you take the pedals off the moped, then it becomes probably then the moped. But if it's got pedals, isn't it the same thing? Like, I mean, what, what makes the, uh, what makes them different other than, to me, the pedals really, or some people are going to say, I'm sure, the speed of the bike well I believe they the moped is classed the moped when it can go 30 miles per hour and you know I think almost all e-bikes or a lot of them can go 30 miles an hour so that's no different there So, um, I don't know what makes them think one's any different. Like, moped, doesn't that stand for motor pedals? Moped, short for mo. Uh, mo is short for uh, motor, and ped is short for pedals. That's a moped. Well, all of the electric bikes really would be a moped. They've got pedals and a motor. So, maybe you can help me out here and let me know what you think defines a moped and what are the differences between a moped electric moped and an electric bike or bicycle I know a, a moped you need a real moped if you class it as a moped needs a license registration and the whole bit whereas an electric bicycle doesn't but I don't think you can define something just on speed because even if a, even if the speed is 30 miles an hour what if you only ride at 20 is it then class the bicycle because you're not riding it the 30 miles per hour I'm sure it's uh, well you can go round and round on this topic but I just brought it up because I get uh, several every now and again, or maybe more often than now and again, comments where uh, people just simply say to me, that's a moped. Are they trying to say that I'm supposed to register it as a moped? if that's the case then why are the bike companies that are selling the bikes 
selling it as a moped with the VIN number. Anyway, like I say, we could probably go round and round on this topic, but I'd like to hear some opinions on this and thoughts. Not that it really matters, but it's just interesting because, like I say, I got a lot of people commenting that it's a moped, whether it's this bike or the uh, their graffiti that I have as well. That I mean, they look different than a typical bicycle, I guess. But then the mopeds that I remember back in the uh, 70s and 80s I mean they had pedals on them they had a motor on them and you would pedal to start the bike and then the motor would would take over kind of thing Regardless of what it is, I enjoy riding it and I will continue to enjoy riding my e-bike, e-moped or whatever it is. Hello? So if you want to uh, leave a comment in the comments below, I'd be interested in uh, seeing what you all have to say. Whether you agree or disagree, maybe you can fill me in on things that I don't know. And that's going to do it for another video here on the channel. If you like this video, hit that like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and thank you very much for doing that. And if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, just hit that notification bell and you'll be notified. And if you want to leave a comment on this or any other video, go ahead and leave that in the comments below. Once again, thank you for joining me for this video. And until next time.